How much is this? 600 naira, the money I want to agree on. I'll be rushing off. I have an important meeting. Come now. Is that all you want to give to me? But that's what we agreed on. Can't you see the work is too much? Can't you see it? Huh? Maji. Where are you going? I am going back to my parents' house. Why? But I did not ask you to leave. I don't care. I can no longer stay with a husband who cannot protect me. Eh? Every time you're supporting the neighbors against me. Or are you sleeping with any of them? Uh -uh. Don't talk like that. You know very well that your dear is pregnant. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I am going. In that case, if you step out of this house, don't you ever come back. I won't. I will not come back, foolish man. Maji! Maji! <laughs> Paid you what we agreed on. So what else? Okay. Okay. Take it, Tom. You can go and finish this many one by yourself. Obidike. Obidike. You know, things are very hard. Eh? Can you even believe that I had to pay 15,000 Naira for my brake pad yesterday? Pad? Yes, for my car. Anyway, you're talking to yourself. When you bring more money, I will come and finish it. Give my knife. Obidike. Obidike. Obidike, come back here. Obidike. Eh. Obidike. You swine! Huh? What did you call me? Huh? My mother is a swine! Look at his head!
scared man. It's your mother you will kill, not me. You bless man. You're driving a car. Hey! Hey! Can you imagine? God! Chineke! He came! Come and see Ikeme full of all. He? I'm fine. I'm just arriving. How is Lagos? Oh, as Lagos has always been. <laughs> so, did you come to see me or you were uh, going to your sister's house? Oh, I came to see you. I'll come and see my sister later. <laughs> it is nice to know that we are still in Portanto. He came. He came. Whose car is this? It's mine. You bought the car? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Congratulations, he came. Are you serious? Yeah, very serious. <sighs> now I know this Lagos girls will not leave you alone. Oh, come now. You know I have eyes only for you. <laughs> Good boy. Who is even interested in yourself? I know you are. <laughs> anyway, where are you off to? Choir practice. Okay. Hop in, let me drop you. Oh, come on. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Been a long time. No. Good to see you again. Good to see you again. <laughs> Come on. Let me give you the star treatment. Hey. Kim, this is a big car. Mm. What is it this time? Mama, it's all over. I am through with you today. I'm not going back to that house again. Why? How did it happen this time around? Mama, he uses me as his punching bag. Look at my face. Look at. He goes out drinking and when he comes back, I become his plaything. Even this morning, he beats me up because I asked for feeding money. Me, I don't want to die in his house. I'm not going back to that house again. I'm not going back to that house again. Every day he keeps beating me, beating me. Good evening. Huh? So you are back again. You are back again. I warned you. I warned you. What is the matter with that one? Who knows? Huh? Selling your things. When you have fully rested, we we'll talk about this. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. 
<laughs> he came. Huh. Welcome. Machi, what, what are you doing at home? Your husband is at it again. That hopeless man wants to kill my daughter before her time. Okay. Welcome. They will be decay. You brought this? Yes. Good. Let people come. Let people like Dave Philemon come to use me like a papa again. I threw his money to his face this morning. Huh? Huh? Look at it. A cat or her name. <laughs> you bought this? Sir. Yes, Papa, I did. Congratulations, my son. <laughs> I also have a flat of my own. And now that business is picking up, I would want Deo Bidike to come with me to Lagos. There's no future here, but with two of us in Lagos, we'll surely find a way of making something out of our lives. Mm. You have spoken well, my son. May God be praised. Amen. Uh, Obidike is a man. The decision is his to make. Uh, Obidike. You know the way is fast, so the earlier I leave, the earlier I'll get there. Mm. Did you say you come? I don't know. Okay, maybe when I finish my exams. Ah, that'll be the end of the year. Okay, what's the hurry? You have to hurry up or before Lagos girls steal me away. Let them try it. Let them just try it. Then I'll show them why I am called Rosemary Oti. <laughs> I'll come. Okay. Come. Have this and buy something for yourself. Oh. Come on, take it. You can. Come on. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'll write you when I get back. I'll be waiting. Take care of yourself, all right? Okay. You want to say hi to my brother? Yeah. They'll be the case. <laughs> Good morning. Oh, my dear. How are you? Fine, sir. Save Johnny. Oh, thank you very much. Save Johnny. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm. Take care of yourself. Okay. I'll be expecting you. I'll be waiting for that right. Okay. Take care of yourself. What is it? What was all that for? What? What just happened now? How do you mean? Was that not Otiba's daughter? Uh -huh. Was it not her father's brother's son that almost killed your, 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 your sister? Were you not a witness to what happened to her? So what has that got to do with Rosemary? Uh -huh. So you must waste all your money on her. 
Look, I just decided to give a friend of mine some money to help her out. I don't see any problem with that. Okay, okay. While you are dashing money here and there, remember you have responsibilities. I don't need to be reminded of them. Where you live? Yes. Uh, over there, right up. How do you know which one is your house? <laughs> Dear, don't worry, you'll soon get used to it. Uh, let me bring out your bag so we can go inside. This way. Don't worry, by the time you stay here for a few weeks, you, you'll get used to everything. Let's go. This way. say that now. I had to put all of this together first. That's why I came to pick you. Hey, this is life now. If we won't continue sitting on this kind of seat all the time, who wants bottom will be as soft as baby soon? <laughs> What is wrong with it? This is too much for a man to eat. But there are two of us. So this is how you feed every morning. While those of us in the village go hungry every day. Again. Then I am doing all I can to help the people in the village. I can't do it all at the same time. I'm not saying you are not trying. I just want you to remember that there are some people Looking up to you, he came. Don't forget your responsibilities. They here. You can have this in case you need to buy anything. I'll go to the market later on and get you some clothes. You don't want to eat again. I'm already late. You see it? You see what I'm saying? Eh? Is this no waste of food while some people are not sure of what to eat this morning? 
What am I doing in Lagos? Dear, I don't understand. Did I come to Lagos to eat your food and stay at the four walls of your house? Dear, things take time to shape up here. You have to learn the market first. Huh? Hey! Poverty. BDK to serve a position first. Why are you trying to upset yourself? I have not asked you to serve apprenticeship. I'm only asking you to be patient till I raise enough money to open a branch of my business for you. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Have you sent some money home? They we just came back from the village now and I left enough with them. That's not my business. I've used my eye to calculate all the money you've been spending for over two weeks. It can be too much. Stop wasting money. Stop wasting money. Look, Dave, I work very hard for my money. And I don't think it's anybody's business how I spend it. Eh. Eh. <laughs> Don't give me a headache. I mean, I can't do it. Now that you say I should go and do it, I can't. Somebody else. Mm -hmm. The soup is for the night. So you have a night. Papa, you are welcome. You're welcome. Uh, you have a letter. A letter? Yeah. I have a letter. I guess it's from uh, Ikem. Ikem. Uh, What is it? Mama! Papa! <laughs> what is it? Oh, you think I said I should come down to Lagos? Mama, things I've worked hard for him! <laughs> May God be praised! When does he want you to come? Papa, he said I should start coming down immediately. He's managing one of Ikem's shops. Hey! Yeah. <laughs> so how is your 
She's your sister, is she not? Yes, and I was going to invite her myself. But we're not ready for her yet. You've not fully settled down and already you're sending for somebody else. Did you ask me if I can support both of you? My friend, stop complaining. After all, you're making enough money to support the Nigerian army. Unfortunately, you never like helping anybody. Look, Day, I don't like the language you're using. You just can't go ahead and invite people into my house without my consent. What is not people? And she's your sister. After she has right to come and enjoy whatever you're enjoying in this house. You still have no right to go ahead and invite her without letting me know first! Uh, are you insulting me? Uh, are you insulting me? Anyway, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. It is because I'm living under your roof. Can you people be eating with pots like this? What will people say if they come in to see this kind of thing? Are you looking for who to insult? Oh, yeah. What do you mean am I looking for who to insult? Don't we have enough plates in the house? Isn't that the dining table? My friend, stop shouting. Is that the greeting you're supposed to greet to elders? If I live in this house, then I should be able to eat wherever I like. After all, in the village, eat wherever you like. Oh! This is not the village. This is my house. Bianule. Is it no lot is around we how? Bianule, is it no lot ya kawatro we ha? Ha boru donanji kota si yo. Ma hui kumpu rojo, nanya karisi ya. Sister, this should be enough to buy some foodstuffs and also to prepare something for this evening. Did you lock 
pulls Mary out of the house. I said, why did you lock Rosemary out of the house? Lock who out of the house? You heard me very well. Why did you lock Rosemary out of the well, house? Rosemary did not ask to enter the house. But you saw her sitting on the stairs. Ah. So if I see any riffraff from your Tsingwa clan sitting on your staircase, I should throw the door wide open, carry them in with the full compliment of at local dancers. Look, don't be sarcastic. I invited Rosemary to Lagos and you have no right to treat her the way you just did. And I take exception to your calling her a riffraff. Mm. So I should start dancing because you invited a girl from that clan who had not started taking her back properly. Nonsense. I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to cause any fight between you and your sister. It's okay. I'll sort things out. Come with me. Saved your food. Is that why you woke me up? Is that why you walked into my room without knocking? Sister, I'm sorry, it's just that I've served the food. I didn't want it to get cold. You didn't want it to get cold. You think you're smart, eh? You want me to go and eat the food now before the poison you put in it wears off? Oh. You think I don't know that all you want to do is to get rid of all of us so that you alone can enjoy my brother's money. But I tell you. You have failed. Now get out of my room! Stop. I said get out! Get out! I don't want to be responsible for the death of any member of your family. Rose. Rosemary of putting poison in the food. I'm looking for trouble. Hmm. You have started again. I did. You can. I did. And you should open your eyes because you've been asleep for too long. Listen, you two. Rosemary is the girl I want to marry, and I demand some respect from both of you. Otherwise, I will not hesitate to ask you to leave my house. Something terrible has happened to your senses. Let me tell you, you will marry an Otiwa, but over my dead body. As I'm throwing me out of this house. <laughs> You don't know your elders anymore. I don't know what you have against Rosemary. 
But whatever it is, put it in your pocket. Because I will not take kindly to your treating her shabbily again. Rosemary! Rosemary! Out of my dead body! She Ma sold her leg to walk out of this house. She is not coming back. She is not coming back. She is not coming back. Ah! Your husband's people. Yes, Mama. Money and cousin. Ah, she's a good girl. Oh. She served us during your banco years back. Mama, you don't know her. That girl is a pretender. She swore that once she entered this family, Ikem will never come home again. Eh? She has already concluded plans with Ikem to build a house for her father while you still live in this house. He is even planning to throw us out of the house so that she can bring in her brothers. Uh, when do you propose to go back? Tuesday morning. Tell Ikem to stop whatever he's doing and make sure that he gets here immediately. Yes, Papa. Tell him that it is a matter of life and death. Yes, Papa. Ah, I want Ikem to be careful that he does not fall into wrong hands. See where he has ended. Is that all you have to say? Are we going to fold our hands and watch it happen? I know what to do. I know exactly what to do. Who got you? Ukachi! Come and open the door for your husband and put a smile on that face. He's not going to bite you. He came. Sister, you're welcome. Yes. How are you? Fine. How is everybody? We're fine, babe. Thank Mama, you. Papa. We are fine. He came. Ukadi, come and greet your husband properly. Good evening, sir. What did you say? Papa said I should bring her so that you see her before they start the talk. Her name is Ukadi. What talk? Your marriage. What kind of nonsense is this? Hey, look here. I don't want to be uncivil to you, but I think it will be in your best interest to leave right now before I lose my temper. Leave! She's not going anywhere. Is that so? Yes. We shall see. Ukachi. 
What are you doing here? Eh? It's okay, it's okay. Look. I'm sorry about the way I treated you. I was angry. Please forgive me. No, thank you. I'm not angry with you. You said I was angry with me. It's okay, I'm no longer angry. You're a beautiful girl. You know what? Go to your room and lie down. Yes, I'll join you soon. Come down now. This way. You can what is the matter? You can have her back. But thank you, I don't want her. He came. He came. If this is the reason why you summoned me from Lagos, then you had better release me, let me get back to my business. You will listen when I'm talking to you. You're not talking to me, Papa. You are ordering me to take somebody in and throw out the girl I want to marry just because OBDK and Machi think she's there to guzzle my money away. Where were they when I was sleeping in the gutters of Lagos? Do you know the kind of encouragement I have received from that girl you are asking me to throw out? Chineke, them giving my son something to eat. Mama, the only thing Rosemary has given me to eat is love and care. And I will have you know that I will eat it over and over and over again. I can see your heart is hardened. But if you will not take advice, you will not get my blessing on your marriage. Papa, if you do not bless me, God, who sees and knows everything, will bless me. You can come back. You don't talk to your father like that. Leave him. The eagle roams the sky, but it will end up in its small nest. He will come home. This is not the way to come and ask for a wife. Besides, my daughter has told me all she suffered in the hands of your sister and brother when she came to visit you. I do not think I want her to go through that again. Mama, I have not come to ask for a wife. I know the right thing to do. What I have come to do is ask Rose for forgiveness for the way she was treated. 
I have made my choice and there is nothing anybody can do about it. Rose, you know with me around nobody can treat you badly. Mama, I also want to let you know that as soon as possible, I'll come and make my intentions concrete. Rose, please accept my apologies. I'm sorry. Shut up! What kind of stupid bargaining is that? Do you think I am selling her out here? Yeah? Look, Mr. Shut man. Shut up! Shut up! Poor man! Get out of my shop! You must be frustrated. Though. It is your great grandfather that is frustrated. Boy, you are not. Nuri. Poor man. That's how they spoil people's day. Hey, it's 12 noon already. What am I doing here? Let me just park and go home. <laughs> She has gone out with Ike. You forget today is the day Ike is meeting with her parents for her wine carry. So Ike has gone ahead to marry Rosemary. Despite everybody's opposition. What is even more worrisome is that Rosemary is making progress in this house despite everything. Good morning. Uh, you left before I woke up. 
Uh, uh, how are you? Uh, play, 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 play. Uh, oh, I should go market. Uh, not bad, not bad. Yeah, market. Uh, okay. Uh, yes, you are finished. Hey, you have not sold anything yet. Huh? I said you have not sold anything. Is it my fault? People are running away from your shop. Huh? Nobody has walked into this shop for the past two weeks. It's almost as if they are avoiding this shop. Avoiding? How? Why? How would I know? Am I in their minds? Uh, play, 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 play. Play. <laughs> if this continues, I may have to close this shop. Okay. <laughs> I want you to take a look at this. Can't you see a bit? What is inside it? The loan facility I took from the bank to open the shop for you is due for repayment. And you have not made any single return on the investment. So what am I supposed to do? Drag people from the street to come and buy something in your shop? Huh? I see people are running away from your shop. You are talking about returns. I'm trying to be reasonable. I don't know how you can be so, so nonchalant. If I don't pay back this loan by the end of the month, banks will close the shops and I'll be in a mess. That is your own responsibility. After you took the loan. So that's the thanks I get for trying to rescue you from waste, poverty and want in the village? Can't you allow me to eat in peace? You know you've always been a failure in everything. And you still are. Your sister called me a witch. She said I have been eating all the babies in my stomach. You, can. you know how hard I have tried to please your people. How I have wanted to get pregnant. It's okay. Is that all? Look, my sister is a misguided person. I am the one that matters here, and I have not called you a witch. Pull yourself together. Children are a gift from God, and I am prepared to wait. Come on. Hey, hey, hey. You've not eaten, have you? to the kitchen and prepare you something to eat. Is that okay? Come on, give me a smile. <laughs> That's better. I love you. Very chicken.
to matter. Your sister poured soup on me. It came. Machi. This little girl had the guts to put two pieces of meat for me in my soup. I already explained to her that there were only two pieces of meat left in the house of both of us. And I gave them to her. She insisted I go and get me, but why? Shut up! So you decided to waste the soup by pouring it on her? go on like this. I am carrying an unnecessary burden and it's affecting me. I think you should go back to the village since you're not doing anything here. They will be decaying. I have closed the shop at Alaba because you could not render any returns. And the bank is breathing down my neck. That simply means I should pack a return to the village. I have not said that yet. You don't have to say it for me to understand. Eh? You think we are your problem? You can open your eyes. Your problem is inside your bedroom. It is with the girl you marry. Since you married that girl, and from the first day she stepped into this house, things turned upside down. She can't even conceive. I keep wondering if I came from the same womb with both of you. Wickedness flows in your veins. Machi, you were married for four years. Did you conceive for one day? And that was not because I was a witch like her. But because my useless husband, her brother, refused to touch me. Oh, don't give me that crap anymore. I now know what happened between you and your husband. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Is that what your wife has been telling you? I told you she's a witch. You came open your eyes. You disgust me. Just go in there, pack your things and leave. You don't have to force us. You don't have to force us. We will leave. But be rest assured that I, Obidike, will make sure you receive all your due reward for the way you treated us. You will not lay your hands on any family property. Because I want to hide, I see no longer in my heart. I'm out. 